I'm going to earn this. What's going on, guys? Uh, so, okay, real quick. I'm in Maine right now. I'm traveling. I'm at my parents' house. If you notice, the surroundings are different. Uh, both of them, my mom's at work, and my dad is out digging worms. Um, check that out online, crazy stuff. Anyways, so... Uh, I wanted to do a workout. I was going to do Asylum. Uh, today I was like, I'll just do Asylum Speed and Agility, right? Because just because you're on the road, I'm trying to set an example, because you're on the road does not mean that you cannot get in your workout. You might not be able to do P90X with weights because you can't carry those with you, but I brought my ladder and I brought my rope. However, I've changed my mind. You just saw that P90X for results and recovery. I just developed my own workout for today. I'm in the country. Why the hell not? I'm going fully primal. So let me show you what I just did. I'm going to walk you around real quick and I'm just going to get to it. i got to make this fast before my battery dies. So check it out. Um, I am doing this entire thing here. I'm just going to walk outside and show you. I mean, I don't expect to read this. I kind of want to make a blog post about this with the video and break down what I did. So instead of trying to read this, let me go show you firsthand exactly what I am about to do. All right. Um, let's see if I can get this. Okay, we're walking outside here. So... Let me lay it. I'm going to do everything right here, right in the front yard, pretty much. Kind of some of the backyard, too. So, check this out first thing. My parents grow a garden. How cool is that? I mean, I didn't appreciate this when I didn't when I, when I I used to live here. Now that I don't, uh, I kind of wish I had this living in Florida. A nice organic garden, not to mention that uh, a couple miles down the road, there's an organic beef farm. Uh, all the stuff I live off now, but whatever. So, check this out. Here's what I'm going to do for my workout. So, first thing, it's going to be a whole primal set. See this driveway? I don't know if you can see the depth. Oh, my rental car, huh. uh, about 300 yards, this driveway. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start out with four sprints. I'm doing kind of a ladder set, so I'm going to run up to the top of this driveway, right to the tip there, stop, rest 30 seconds, run back down, uh, right probably to the garage here, rest another 30 seconds. I'm going to do that four times. And what I'm going to do is just move right along here. I'm going to run over here. I'm going to grab one of these kayaks. They're not too, too heavy, but I'm going to grab one and uh, do over the head. I'm going to put it over my head. I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to run it over. See that pole? Uh, I think you can see it way over there. There's kind of an electric pole uh, straight ahead in the middle of the screen. I'm going to run over there, set it down, and I'm going to rest uh, somewhere around 30 seconds, pick it up, run back over here, set it down again, rest another 30 seconds. I'm going to do this four times, and you'll get the gist of this in just a sec why I'm doing these four times. So I'm going to do that. Then I'm going to run over here. Okay, the next thing I'm going to do, check out the camper. Isn't that cool? Uh, oh, also, I've got my... Uh, the posture is like I love these shoes. I live in them. The uh, the the Merrell Vibram bottoms. As you can see, it kind of dirty, but um, amazing shoes. Anyways, so right over here, I've got a stack of rocks. How cool is that, right? So I'm gonna pick up some of these big ones. I actually I just tested this one here. Pretty heavy. I'm gonna pick this up. Kind of do functional low squat. You can't see what I'm doing. Well, maybe you can see my shadow. Kind of a that's cool. Getting a low squat. I'm gonna pick these up. Kind of functional fitness. I'm going to pick it up, bring it into my chest, rotate, and throw it into a pile here. Pick it back up, and I'm just going to keep moving. Watch, I'm going to move these rocks into a pile. I'm going to do this for four minutes. Okay. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to stop there. I'm going to run over here. And I scouted out a bunch of different trees. This is the one I found the most exciting. I'm going to take this tree here, and for four minutes, I'm going to climb up and try to get to these. The, right where the leaves kind of start, there's two right in the center of the screen. Those, the two, there, you see kind of four limbs here branch off. The two that go up and kind of narrow, and then there's two more smaller branches. I'm going to try to go up, touch those two, hang off those, come back down. I'm going to do this as many times as I can for four minutes. So you get a, a pattern here, four minutes. Okay, so next thing I'm going to do after I do that, I'm going to drop here, and I'm going to do a ladder set of push-ups. Just quick push-ups. I'm going to do, um, the way I was kind of reading doing these, I'm going to do uh, a max rep, kind of a ladder set. So I'm going to do as many as I can, as many as I can without touching my knees to the ground, uh, for however long it takes, so uh, and then I'm going to equally rest as long. So, for example, say I do, uh, shoot, I don't know, say I do my max rep, whatever, in, um, in 46 seconds, and then that's when I'm done. So I stop, I rest for 46 seconds. I'm going to do this again, see how long I can go max rep till I touch down. Obviously, I'm going to be more fatigued, so I'll probably touch down sooner. So say 30 seconds the second time through. So uh, then I rest for 30 seconds. See, get the gist there? Then the third round, say I do 20, I, I last for 20 seconds, then I rest for 20 seconds. I'm going to do four sets of max rep doing exactly that pattern. Okay, then I stop. Then I rest for two minutes. And what I'm going to do is repeat that entire thing again. I'm going to do it four times total. So where I did four sprints, four kayak overhead runs, uh, four minutes in the rocks, four, four minutes on the tree here, some sort of bug on that tree, uh, and, uh, and the four sets. 
Okay, the, the, everything but the push-ups. Push-ups are always going to remain four sets max rep. That just is what it is. Uh, yeah. So what I'm going to do, though, the second time after my two minutes rest, repeat everything, one through five. However, I'm going to do three max sprints, three kayak overhead, three minutes on the rocks, three minutes on the tree, and still, again, four sets max rep push-ups. And I'm going to repeat this until I get down to one. So one sprint, one kayak, one minute with the rocks, probably putting them back where, they were, where I got them, one minute up and down the tree, and, uh, and then four final max rep burnout push-ups, and that is my workout. That's what I'm doing today. So pretty damn excited. I just put this whole thing together instead of doing a, uh, the asylum. I figured, why not? Uh, I'm in the country. There's not really a lot of snakes or any crazy stuff that's going to bite me like that would happen in Florida. So I'm going to run all around the property here where I grew up, and I'm going to get this done. So that's my workout today. Do something for yourself. Look, I'm on vacation. I am traveling right now. I'm at my parents' house. I have my asylum with me, but I'm doing what it takes. I'm using what's around me to get in some good functional fitness. Make sure to warm up, make sure to cool down, and also, uh, of course, take care uh, of good form. Very, very important. So that's uh, one thing I'm definitely going to try to practice here, when, especially when I'm picking up rocks. Good form. So that's it. That's my workout. Go do what it takes. I'm doing what it takes. You should be doing what it takes. And post to tell me what you're doing on my Facebook. Take care. Oh, okay. I'm on the... I'm in the break in my, uh, I just finished my second set, so it's going to get easier, but this is where I have to really work, and I don't know what the hell I was thinking of four sets. I am dying, uh, but I want to try to get some video to show you my accountability that I'm not just talking. I want you to see what I'm doing. So, I'm going to try to set this up. Hopefully you can see. I don't know what I was thinking when I came up with this set. Okay, but so that's that. I'm gonna finish up. Probably spitting everywhere. I got a uh, one more run through. So one sprint, one kayak, one minute on the rocks, one minute up and down the tree as many times as I can, and four more sets of max rep push-ups. A couple minutes to break here. Have some water. See you when I'm done. Okay, friends, Primal Fitness completed. Uh, that was ridiculous, look at this. I, I took my shirt off the last round because I was sweating like crazy. And I inevitably ended up covered in all kinds of stuff and I'm dripping. So, anyways, oops. <laughs> like this, my arm. Uh, so that was a little crazy, and the funny thing is, uh, let me see... Uh, oh crap, the, the thing, my stopwatch changed. Anyways, 
uh, literally exactly one hour. Uh, a little longer than I wanted to go. I only like to usually do like 20 minutes to 40 minutes, but that was pretty crazy. So, as I said at the beginning, I earned it. <clears throat> I'm going to enjoy this, take a shower, and put this video together, which of course you've seen the aftermath. But, that was my primal workout. And I literally just thought this up. I went outside and decided, you know what? Let's try something a little bit different. Let's shock the body. So uh, that's what I did. That's the tree I was just climbing, if you can see, kind of out the window, right in the middle. Anyways, Jason Croxford here. Go do what it takes.